Hi everyone, this is Palvinda. Welcome to the next and last day of your challenge where I will be going to show you what is look like audience, how you can create it and how you can target for the better result that you are looking for. Before start the look like audience, you need to be understand about it. what is look like audience. Basically guys, this is the Facebook tool where Facebook allows you to find out more audience based on your custom audience. That will be your cold audience, but this will be based on your custom audience what does it mean guys remember in the last day day 13 we have created our custom audience the people who already comes on our website which means that the people come on our website they are interested in our product uh, we consider like the way they have their own interest they have their own behavior they have their own demographic now facebook will create the similar or Facebook will find new audience based on the similar characteristic of your custom audience right make sure that for look like audience you have to be have a custom audience in your pixels you have to be have the data and you need to be create the custom audience and based on the custom audience you will be allowed to create a look like audience so that will be a similarity of your custom audience the similar characteristic of your custom audience that's called a look like audience then how you can create it if you're on the screen um, remember we created our retargeting campaign but firstly we have to create a look like audience based on the custom audience and how we can create it you can come it here and you need to be click on this audience tab if you are not going to find it you will be able to find it somewhere here make sure that you are on the right you are on the right account right so i will be click it here once i will be click it here that will be redirect me to here and remember we created this custom audience uh, all website visitor and the custom audience we have this facebook page visitor last 30 days so based on that i will be creating a look like audience how you can create you just need to be click it here and you will become on the look like audience and if you want more information if you're confused you can read this one and you will be get a clear idea about the look like audience so i'm going to click it here and now this is what they asking for for creating a look like audience you need to be select the source now what is the source as i mentioned you we already have been created the custom audience that will be our source right source where you are going to collect the data and which you are looking for so i'll click it here or you can create a new one so uh, we already created i'm going to show you down but you need to be click into this box and you will be able to find this value based source and other source value based source at the moment you do not need to be go for it because you do not have much data you do not have the people who bought the product from you this will be based on the purchase event the people comes on your website and they already have been purchased if you click it here and the facebook will be find the people most likely similar who would like to be able to um, uh, buy the product from you but you do not have much data do not worry about it at the moment but we will be going for other source what would be our other source our other source will be our website visitor the visitor who comes on my website i would use like that one as my source the custom audience which we created right i click it here so now i have selected the source or if you do not have custom audience you can create it here as well but since the best practice is first create the custom audience that will be give you a clear understanding what you are doing rather than confused so we already create the custom audience first then based on that we will be used as a source based on that we will be create a look like audience now select the audience location if you want to run your campaign in your country then find it if you want to be run campaign in another country then you can put it here as well since i'm going to just use this in new zealand i'm going to put the new zealand or if i'm going to use this audience or finding the audience in australia i will be put in australia you can add multiple as well where you want to be run that has so facebook will be find people in 
based on the country right so i'll just put this for new zealand at the moment since this is the new one and i will be just keep it as in a simple right now select the audience side what does it mean guys number of the look like audience this will allow you to create more than one look like audience since you are a beginner put just one at the moment if you want more information you can click at this i option and you will be get this all option it here that you can create a multiple look like with different level of similarity of your source this will allow you to build differently for the audience the facebook will create a different audience for you and you can target differently but rather than going to confuse at the moment keep the best practice and simple practice once you will be good to go then you can play around it so i'll just keep it just one at the moment right if you put two the facebook created two audience um list for you if you put three they will be created three for you let the moment just keep it one now this is the important thing about the percentage i'll put one percent here you need to be understand these things guys a one percent look like consist of the people who are most similar to your look like audience source if you put one percent facebook will find the people most likely to be uh, most likely to be interest behavior demographic of your custom audience right if you put two percent they will be capture um more people but they have less similarity of based on your custom audience if you put three percent they will be have less four more less make sense like that why so i put just one percent rather than two percent just put the one person means they are most similar to my custom audience right so they are most likely to be have a, a similar characteristic in may interest behavior dem demographic based on my custom audience so what i will be do i'll be just going to click this one create and it has been created here so here you will be able to see the look like new zealand one person and the old website visitor this will be our custom audience source now it's going to be populating it takes just five to ten minutes sometime more and you can filter it here as well if you want to be just find the look like audience custom audience or saved audience what you can do you can go for the type click it once you click it you will be able to find the all custom audience once you click look like audience you will be able to find look like audience if you click the save audience you will be able to see the save audience so this is the thing you can create it so so just play around it at the moment how you can create the look like audience create it based on your custom audience do not worry about at the moment whether you have more data or not but just do the practice if you do the practice you will be learn more once you will be run your more campaigns then you will be have a lots of data and you can create this one so practice um make some men perfect do the practice do that create the look like audience in the next below video i'm going to show you actually how you can target those look like audience um, with the campaign and what sort of the measurement what sort of the metrics you need to be follow and see on it i hope that will be help you out guys thank you so much create a look like audience see you in the next video thank you